John Morris has been a smoker for more than 50 years. It's a, it's a cigarette, but it's not. And that's the, that's the good thing about it. But it's really a smoke-free electronic cigarette that satisfies his nicotine addiction. He says using the patch, gum, even hypnosis hasn't helped him kick the habit. It really does work. Experts say there's no medical data proving e-cigarettes can actually help someone quit. What's remarkable actually is the lack of evidence that these products are any better than standard smoking cessation treatments and secondly the inadequate testing for their toxicity. The amount of nicotine each cigarette delivers can vary but smokers say it feels like the real deal. You take a puff and the cigarette lights up. It creates a smoke-like vapor and delivers a dose of liquid nicotine. You get into the thing of the hand, the puff, the Tobacco smoke is the leading preventable cause of death in the U.S., but e-cigarettes don't contain any tobacco and don't produce the smoke that real cigarettes do. Some doctors are recommending e-cigarettes to patients fighting nicotine addiction. What they should try to do is try to get the tobacco out of their bodies, and this device undoubtedly affords them the opportunity to do that. I think it's going to help. The FDA hasn't recommended using e-cigarettes and has blocked foreign shipments to the U.S., but thousands of smokers like John Morris trying to quit are willing to try anything. In New York, I'm Karina Mitchell.